Port Botany has gone to the dogs. Okay, pup. Three canines from Queensland, to be precise, brought down to sniff out an infestation of red imported fire ants. The ant is quite aggressive and inflicts very painful stings and it will sting livestock, animals, humans that, it, that encounter its nests. Um, it has a serious environmental impact. It will um, wipe out other ant species and have serious impact on the macroflora. It's the first time the ants have been found in New South Wales and while Queensland has them, genetic tests show these ants didn't originate there. An investigation's underway into where the ants came from and how they got here. An eradication program started to ensure the ants don't spread. If these things were not controlled and allowed to, to spread, um, they would get into our parks, our golf courses, uh, our national parks and those sorts of things, uh, and on farmland, and have a serious impact on, on everything that we do. OK, ready, ready, ready? Search it up. But it's the odour detection dogs Willow, Mikey and Olivia who have the most important job, sniffing out the pests among more than 50 other ant species in the area. After um, we've had nests located and they've been destroyed and the area's been baited and treated, uh, their job is to go around and, provo and provide proof that it's worked, it's been effective and that there's no fire ant left in that area. Ah, good puppy! The fire ants are reddish-brown in colour and up to six millimetres in length. If you see any in New South Wales, send photos to this email address or call the exotic plant pest hotline.